Right now, Jeff Edmondson has something that really, really affects our forecast, and that is the jet stream, and of course, Arctic uh, sea ice is controlling uh, much of what goes on with the jet stream. Yeah, let's take a look at that. So as we go now to our first day, first full of days of spring uh, is tomorrow. But springtime is basically here. We look at the Arctic sea ice. How much has it expanded across the poles, at least for the North Pole, the South Pole, the Antarctic? It's at minimum right now because summertime down there going into fall. But for us, we're going into spring and eventually into summer. So the extent of the sea ice is at its max. The yellow line is the average from 1981 to 2010. So we're below below that as we have been pretty much every year. We're always below average as the globe continues to warm up. But this year, not as far down for, from the average. It's the 15th lowest on the satellite record for the maximum. Last year was the second year uh, lowest on record, and then in 2012 was the lowest year on record again since the satellite era began because that's how we can see what's going on with the Arctic sea ice. Now, as we get that ice to melt away, as it shrinks a little bit, we get more kind of perturbations or disruptions in the jet stream. A very smooth jet stream would just be a nice circle around the North Pole. But you see how there's all of these dips and ridges that go all across the Northern Hemisphere? That brings in pushes of warm air or into our area pushes of cold air like we have right now. So we get more of these big swings in temperature where we get these huge warm spells and we get these cool spells. The opposite of the cool air that we have here is in Alaska where it's unseasonably warm. So big changes happening across the globe because of where we are on that Arctic sea ice below average, but not the lowest on record, at least for this year. We'll keep a close eye on this and we'll preview more of our springtime temperatures as time allows. I'm Jeff Edmondson, 10 on your side.